An aggressive shark sighting halted a surf contest at Ala Moana Bowls this afternoon. Warning signs are posted to keep people out of the water. Nikki Schenfeld has more. Around 11 a.m., witnesses say they spotted a large fin in the shallow water nearby. And I saw like a fin pop out in the corner of my eye and I was like, oh, it's probably just a turtle. Like we see turtles every day. And then I started seeing like thrashing and I saw the other two surfers like react and I was like, it's big enough for me. Witnesses say there were two 11 year olds out at the time the shark started thrashing just feet away. A lot of uh, white water and then uh, a Molly ran over there on the jet ski and uh, noticed it was a 10 to 12 foot tiger shark thrashing. And so we uh, got all the contestants out of the water at that moment in time. And then we evaluated it and we made a quick uh, decision to uh, cancel the event for the day just for safety reasons. Sharks are always there and I feel like I've always seen like, you know, reef sharks and stuff and it's never really bothered me. I think it was just like the aggressive nature of it. Witnesses say this shark was about 12 feet in length and shark experts say it's highly unlikely that it was the same shark that bit Mike Morita just three weeks ago, a few surf breaks down due to its size difference. Tiger sharks, they move around the heck of a lot. So it's extremely unlikely that this fish is the same one. However, the fact that it is where it is may be due to the same reason. We had a lot of rain yesterday that came down the mountains, flushed out the alawai into the ocean, and all those interesting smells and tastes will just draw the sharks in to investigate. Dr. Rossiter believes the shark was eating a turtle at the time and says the thrashing behavior is usually when they have something in their jaws. Did they make the right call to call off this surf? Absolutely yes. Absolutely yes. You know, when, it, when it's sharks in the water, especially in, when the water's in that condition, they're extremely unpredictable. They are looking for food and it's too easy for the shark to make a mistake. Contest organizers will decide tomorrow morning if it can resume. Nikki Schoenfeld, KHO2 News, working for Hawaii.